here there are two buttons that you see add predictive model and add foundation model now here under the predictive model you don't have any models whereas under generative you see bunch of these models that are already available and you can customize these models as well and we saw that how to do it by changing their parameters now here if I want to create a predictive model I have two options one is to create the model from scratch or second option is to connect with the outside model so if there is a model that is available and I created under Amazon or Google Cloud Vertex I can connect those models with uh, Salesforce and that option would be available in my list of models that are there I can do that so if I click on connect an Amazon SageMaker model it is going to ask me information about where the model is what is the URL what is the uh, secret key all of that information I don't have any of this information because I don't have a model set up and you don't need from the exam perspective but you know you need to know that you can connect your own models within this model builder okay you can bring your own large language model and you can connect them and all this information will be available to you if you have an outside model similarly if you want to create your own uh, model you can choose this create a model from scratch option so here I'm going to choose the option of add predictive model again and there is an option to create from scratch so I'm going to go ahead and click on next here <laughs> 